So let's, I guess let's start with this. We're talking about these huge sets. What is it like to, to act and, and be in a film with these sets are this massive? Well, it helps because you don't have to act. Yeah. Right? You don't have to act. And, and I think um, the first time I realized how amazing this movie was going to be mm -hmm. is the first time I walked onto one of these sets. I yeah. mean, like, it's, it's not just the, the set itself and the environment. It's the people that put their time and imagination into these sets. So it makes me feel like I'm in another universe, like the Power Ranger universe, you know? Totally. Now, where does your character fit into the Power Ranger universe? Where does your character fit into Saban's Power Rangers? Well, my character's interesting in a way that it's the character that doesn't actually fit in very well. Hmm. Um, not to spill any secrets, but he's the only person that doesn't really go to school all the time, right? Uh, my character's kind of wild. He likes adventures. You know, he, you know, he's kind of from the other side of the tracks. Um, likes to go off his own way. He's like the lone wolf. Yeah. Um, and then he's just trying to find his pack. You know. Not to be misled. Not saying that if you ba if you bail out of school, you become a superhero. That's not. Yes. <laughs> be cool. Yeah, that's not Stay the case. In school. This is a one a one time thing. But how does it feel to be a part of this giant uh, franchise? To be a part, like to put that suit on for the first time and really realize that you are now a Power Ranger. This is how it feels. In that moment when you put the mask on mm -hmm. and it's like... Who needs some saving? That's what it feels like. You actually, you really feel it. The way it's shot, the, the time we put into this, like the hours of preparation, the way the director directs us, and then when the suits actually showed up and then we step into great sets like this, our spaceship, our command center, it's, it feels incredible. Do they let you take them out for a test drive on the street? Like, it's, you're not, they're not allowed to leave the lot. What, the, the spaceship? The suits, the suits, no? <laughs> no, you're not just hang, like, hanging well, around on a, on a weekend uh, <laughs> in the suit? I would, if I was, if that was me, I would be wearing that thing all the time. Yeah, it's actually not that comfortable, <laughs> to be, to be honest with you. But we get used to it, yeah. That's yeah. so cool, man. Now, yeah. th th this movie's gonna be like big for, of course, all the Power Ranger fans like myself, who's grown up with the Power Rangers, but a lot of new fans. What do you think audiences are really gonna love about Saban's Power Rangers? I think audience, they're gonna love how, how great it is. How truly amazing um, I expect it to be. Like, um, it's gonna be real. They're gonna relate to it. Um, and to me, they told me not to use this word, but to me, the whole thing is about love. So I think they're going to love the love. Love the love? Now, were you a Power Ranger fan going into this? Yeah, totally, man. Yeah? Yeah, I was, uh, um, it was a bit embarrassing, but I was, I was the kid that ran home from school to watch the Power Rangers or Pokemon. Yeah, I was the um, same kid, so okay, don't worry cool. about it. Cool, man. Yeah, buddy. So don't worry, I'm just as excited as, well, maybe more so for you, but to be here and to be on this set is, I'm trying to contain myself. They're like having to like steer me out of rooms and don't go in there. But yeah, it's so cool to like, I guess finally, you know, do you ever think you'd be here growing up with the show and then here you are? No, I, like, how can, how can you imagine, right? But I always, as an actor, um, just two weeks before I booked this role, people were asking me like, what kind of roles do you want to play? I had three in mind, and one of them was a superhero. And then, like, it's always not just a superhero. I wanted to be like a like an avenging angel, you know. Um, and the thing I love about this show is, like I told you before, it's like it's like teamwork, right? A bunch of kids together. Together, you're not just a lone superhero. Although my character is kind of a loner, but you're not just a lone superhero. You eventually end up with a team, right? And it's about diversity saving the world. And I think that's the only thing that can save the world is if we all work together, right? And in other films you see like it's always, you know, it's always an American that saves the yeah. world, right? And now we got some culture, we got some diversity. And we can all save the world together. And I gotta ask, is it gonna be weird to own merchandise with your face on it after this movie's out? Is it gonna be weird to have like your own action figure? Are you gonna display that on your on your dresser at home or <laughs> No, own all the other ones. Will your friends think weird things uh, that they come over and then you have just your face all over your apartment? Because when we're not together, I'll just I'll just own the other ones. I'll get some life size ones. Okay. And I'll just hang out with the Rangers. <laughs> Just this movie will live on forever for you. Yeah, that's right. Maybe I will be able to take the suit out for a test drive then. <laughs> Thanks a lot, buddy. Great chatting yeah, with cheers, you, man. Tanner. Thank, Thank you. you.